Hi, I'm Chase Thompson Ball with Simply Mac in Salt Lake City, Utah. I'm going to show you a quick way that you can put your Apple TV into device firmware update mode, or DFU, in case you need to restore your Apple TV back to factory settings. So we have our Apple TV here. Now, typically what we would do if we need to restore our Apple TV to factory settings is we would come over here to settings on general and then come all the way down to the bottom till we get to reset. And right here we have restore. Restore will go ahead and wipe out the operating system of the drive and it will go ahead and make sure that it's like an out of box condition. You know, you just pulled it right out of the box, it's brand new, no content, none of your settings on it. This is the best and easiest way to do it. However, if you can't do this, maybe for troubleshooting reasons, this is, uh, or now I'm gonna show you how you can easily put this back into DFU mode and restore it on your computer. What you need is you need a micro USB cable like this one right here, okay? So what we're going to do is we're actually just gonna unplug our HDMI cable. We're gonna leave power. You can also leave network if you have that plugged in. And we're gonna plug it into our computer. Now the Apple TV is still on. It's still not gonna to register to the computer just yet. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna take my remote and I'm gonna hold down the menu and I'm gonna hold down the down buttons. You'll see the Apple TV's lights begin flashing as you hold that down. And as soon as it begins flashing, you can let go on the remote. It's gonna take a couple seconds, but then over here on your computer, you will start to see the Apple TV come up and you can go ahead and re restore the Apple TV. That's the easiest way to put it back into DFU mode if you can't use the restore option in the menus on the Apple TV.